Let's, uh, let's cross to our very own Essex girl, Fern McCann, uh, who is uh, going to embark on her own sort of mission a little bit later Hi, with Fern. some snakes. Lovely to see you, Fern. Uh, I understand, Fern, you've already signed this petition. I am. Um, Fantastic. <laughs> I have, and I'm totally for the petition. I think the work that the girls are doing is absolutely fantastic. I just want to say I am an Essex girl, loud and proud, but when I was younger and growing up, I used, I used to feel a bit embarrassed and justify being an Essex girl. I used to say, oh, no, I'm not, your, I'm not your typical Essex girl, and I think that boils down to this misrepresentation that everyone thinks an Essex girl is. You know, the days are gone when we're dancing around our handbags in our white stilettos and the whole shut up. The the majority of Essex girls that I know are grafters, hard-working entrepreneurs, and that needs to be celebrated. Not, you know, sexually promiscuous and materialistic. It's a completely false representation. Well, you can Fern, see I'm very passionate about this. Time. Yeah. Fern, in that um, intro but, yeah, that we great just, work to you girls. In the intro that we just said to you, we said, oh, we're going to cross out to our very own Essex girl. When we say that, we just go, Essex girl, because you are from Essex yes, and, and Towie exactly. and all that sort of thing. Okay. But if I was to cross you in the language that the dictionary states, I go, we're going to cross now to our very own unintelligent materialistic, devoid of taste and sexually promiscuous girl, Fern McCann. Because essentially, as the dictionary that's says, it. that's what I'm saying. That would be awful mm. and wrong and incorrect. And, and, and it's absolutely ridiculous. Exactly. When you say to our very own Essex girl, I'm like, yeah, I kind of... I, I feel proud that I'm an Essex girl, but... People, if you was to say it that way, it would just be ridiculous. So I think it should be changed. I don't think it should necessarily be taken out because it's kind of cool that Essex girl is in the dictionary. You know, you don't hear of Devon girl or Manchester girl. It's cool that our county and yeah. girls is in the dictionary and we're okay. being celebrated, but not. It's just the, it's got the wrong definition. All right, Fern, we're gonna we're gonna catch up with you in a bit. Thanks for being with us. So we've got lots of con um, lots of people getting in contact. Yes, today. Livy <laughs> says my fiance is an Essex boy. We moved there for a few years. There are definitely Essex girls there. Like most stereotypes, though, it's both based on a minority, not majority. Now the key thing, of course, as well, I think, is stereotypes come about for a reason. They don't just sort of get made into a stereotype. That, and that's, that's one of the things. But what we're all saying is it was maybe an outdated Very sense outdated. Yes. of what it is. And Do you... I mean, the, the interesting point about this is they're talking about materialistic as well. Do you consider yourself materialistic, Danny? Not myself personally, no, but I mean, I think Fern made such a good point there. You don't see Manchester girl in the dictionary, do you? The term Essex girl has put Essex on the map and I'm so surprised that she's campaigning to have it changed because... If it wasn't for the term Essex girl, Towie wouldn't exist. But I think but the term might be Essex girl, as in an Essex girl being a confident woman from Essex, is yeah. very different to the derogatory term as it is labelled in the dictionary. It is, but I don't They're think we can pick things. and choose, you know. It's in the I dictionary, think you can. as it is. Have a bit of fun with it, just get over it. Right. And get on with your well, life. Well, we're going to be talking about this all day. Thank you very much, girls. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The term I've spoken about for years is not a new thing. I'm from Essex, this is Sarah. I've never had a spray tan, and all my body hair is my own. <laughs> <laughs> Women from Essex are Essex girls and not all fit this outdated stereotype. It's yeah. all your body hair, your own. Are you asking? <laughs> I'm just, that was merely a sort of I'm a, a rhetorical that to your question. Imagination. <laughs>